Hello, friends. Welcome to Make Your Mornings with Miss Nicole and Miss Alicia. Hi, everyone. Good afternoon or morning. Good afternoon. Morning yet? Yes. <laughs> I think. It's been a long day already. <laughs> All right. <laughs> So we got some fun things this month. We do. I'm so yes. excited about all the cool things we have. Starting with this. Have you guys heard of it? This is our uh, grab-and-go kit for October. Happy October. Yes. Woo, it's October. So this month on Wednesdays, we have four programs. And everything that you need for those four programs are in this nifty bag. They're well supplies last. I don't know how many we have left. But as of right now, we do have a few left. And so our craft we're going to do today is right in this bag. We pull it out. It's this one here. With the bird seed in it. So what are we going to do today? Um, we are making bird feeders. Nice. Yes. It's going to be very cool. Um, we are making bird feeders with bird seed. And one thing I learned from the Kellogg, um, Bird Sanctuary, when they were here last, probably a year ago, is that one of the things we, it seems like we all like to feed the birds is like stale bread. Oh, yeah. You know, people throw bread out in their yard for the birds. I learned from the Kellogg um, Bird Sanctuary that that's actually not good for them. Oh. And that there's a lot of things that people eat that birds shouldn't eat. And that there's not a lot of nutritional value in oh. bread for birds. And so they'll eat that. And then they won't eat like the bird seed and the stuff that's really good for them, and they'll get filled up on that, and then they won't have energy. All right, well that so, makes sense. So we are making bird beers with bird seed. Okay, awesome. And this is a really good thing to make this time of year. And then you can hang it out on a tree during the winter when you know there's no leaves on the trees and everything outside looks dead. Right, and it's harder for the birds to find food. Yeah, it's so hard for them, them to find some. Food. Yeah. So we can we can give them a little snack and try and help them get through the winter. Awesome. So what do we have in our bag? All right. Well, we have the direction. Take your eyes and follow along. We have a craft oh, roll. Hat. Or if you didn't pick up one of these bags, but you happen to have bird seed at home, you could use a paper towel roll or toilet paper roll or something like it's that. It's a toilet paper yeah. roll. Yeah. <laughs> but we'll call it craft roll. It's a sure. craft roll. Sure. Ooh, we've got shortening, so that's the it's a nice fat, and it's gonna bind or adhere the seed to it. You can also use peanut butter or coconut oil. I read. It, it looks shortening. like frosting. Yeah, it does not taste. Like it does frosting. not taste like it. Definitely, you don't want to take a lick. That will be really gross. <laughs> <laughs> we've got bird seed, a nice uh -huh. healthy amount, a popsicle stick, and twine. All right. All right. Okay, so let's get out our directions. Yes. Oh, while we're talking about these, something else really cool. So these are the directions that come in each kit. And there is a little QR code in the corner and on the front of the bag. If you take your smartphone and you scan that, it's going to take you to our YouTube page with all of our videos. So if by chance you miss one, if like, next week, Wednesday morning, you're doing something else, but you still want to see the video and you still want to do the craft, you can just scan this and go to our YouTube page and you can do it whenever is a good time for you. So we've got that too. All right. So we are going to unpack the materials, right, which we've, we've done. That. Yeah. We are going to take our bird seed and empty it onto a flat surface. We grabbed a paper plate. But otherwise, it could be a little messy, which it's okay. okay. We usually yeah. make a little yeah, messy. That's okay. Maybe we won't today. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Take the lid off the plastic shortening. The plastic container, not the plastic short. <clears throat> All right. And then we are going to take our craft roll, take our popsicle stick. Get some shortening out, and then we're going to spread it. Just coat it all over it. And again, this is going to be what helps the bird seed stick to the craft roll. Otherwise, it won't have anything 
to make it stick. Sort of like buttery corn. Yeah. Oh. So this is a hot. So that's a lot right. of butter. <laughs> yeah. It really does look like frosting and icing, it but it's not. It is not. It's tricky. It looks like it would taste so good. Well, then once she's done, <laughs> I'm not good at it. All over the crackle. You're doing an excellent Thank job. You. I don't know why I made you do it. Those birds are going to love us. They are. A lot of good fat. Okay. Yeah, so it's coated. Now you're going to take the craft roll and roll it in the bird seed and get it nice and covered. Oh, oh yeah, it is that. nice and covered. Yeah. See, that's why it needs a lot of you just roll mm -hmm. it around. And I might take this over for the camera. All right, guys. Right. Yeah. So we've got our shortening on there. And we um, have got the bird seed covered with it. See, it's nice and covered. Birds are going to love it. Yes, they are. Okay, so now we are going to. Put I should have said, you need like a baby wiper near a sink or something. Because I now, don't know. We're going to take the twine. We're going to thread it. Maybe. Yeah, that would have made more sense. It's okay. See, this is why. It's all about experimenting. This is why I need you. Okay. So you're going to thread it through. And then you're just going to knot it at the top. Okay. And then, the bird feeder. Awesome. And you just hang it on a tree branch, or if you've got a hook somewhere outside, but a, a tree branch will work great. And you can feed your bird friends all winter. Yes, that sounds good. You can watch them and enjoy it, and they'll get the energy and nourishment that they need yeah. in the, the cold conditions coming up. It's exciting. Yes. <laughs> and I bet once the bird seed is gone, you could probably recoat it. And roll it oh, that's a good point. You probably you can keep reusing it. Yeah. All right. So we hope that you make these. If you do, take a picture, um, especially if some birds. Yeah, that would be pretty it. cool. Take a picture of the bird friends. We would love to see it. And what do what do we need to let people know? Well, next week, um, where is Miss Stephanie going to be with On the Road with Miss Stephanie? She's going to be at Station 66, one of our yes. favorite places. They've got lots of awesome things. Ice cream this time of year. They've got pumpkins and donuts. Oh, yes, donuts. Those are very yes. good. Yes. So lots of, lots of fun fall things to do. And also, October is the library card sign up month for our youngsters so you come up to the children's room or go to the helen warner branch and just get a library card and you get some fun goodies too including this cool yes. bookmark yes. and some other really fun things yes. like um a lanyard to hold your library card and some other cool surprises and i think it's like superhero theme yeah so that should be lots of fun yeah i don't think i'm are we missing anything i don't I don't, I don't think, think so. That. We will know. see you back yeah. here in a month. Um, in November, we will be making zip line. Yes. We are so excited. Yes, it's it's going, going to be fun. So much fun. And we will have grab and go kits for next month as well. Um, and again, don't forget to pick up your kit. You can pick it up from either library location. Just ask at any of the checkout desks for a grab and go kit. And also, our current hours are, we're open to the public, so come see us, our Monday through Friday, we open at noon, we close at six. So those are our current hours, and we hope to see you come visit us, because we really miss you guys.